eh, I don't feel like watching a movie on Disney Plus tonight. I'll do it the old-fashioned way with a VHS tape. What could possibly go wrong? Oh, boy. Hey, what's up, you guys, and welcome back to the world. Now, I know today is supposed to be the Jungle Book 2. Is it really that bad? I'm going to save that for this Thursday. That one is coming, but it's going to come on Thursday. Because today, I decided that we should ha I should have a little bit of a movie night. I haven't actually sat down and watched a movie in, like, it, felt like, it feels like years. And I thought, since... Everybody watches their movies on streaming services like these days. Why not do it the old-fashioned way? How about watch a classic VHS tape? So, huh, this video is going to be about what it's like to watch a movie on VHS with a VCR. Now, as you guys know, I made a video about, about a month ago about fun with old technology, about v VHS and VCRs. But I didn't do a full test of if I can watch an entire tape. So my victim here is The Lion King. Now, The Lion King is very special to me. It's, it's always been one of my favorite movies. In fact, I want to show you guys something. I have something that commemorates the movie. Now, the thing on the left is the actual VHS uh, case, clamshell. Um, the thing on the right is actually a Lion King VHS cover case, which is very cool. Um, when I saw this online, I was like, I, I need to have this. So that's why I got it. And also because Lion King is one of my favorite movies of all time. Now, the backs don't quite match, but the front does. And, they, and Disney got the details spot on with packaging like that like if you noticed this wasn't a phone case you could tap you could see that it would it looks like a VHS tape compared to the actual VHS tape um i couldn't tell a difference i mean yes it is a little bit smaller but i mean i couldn't tell a difference so I was thinking, instead of using a hoity-toity streaming service tonight, how about go back to the 80s, 90s, and early 2000s with watching an actual VHS tape. So we're just going to put the tape in, and we're going to watch it the whole way through. Hopefully, I don't have to rewind the tape, because that's going to piss me off if I do. It's really going to piss me off. Um, but I feel like all the ones that I wanted rewound, rewound I rewound. So we're just going to see. Okay, so we're just going to see if there's a tape and there shouldn't be. And there isn't. So we're going to put, we're going to put the tape in. Okay. And we're going to start to watch the movie. Okay, and I did it. It's set to the beginning of the film, so we're, we're going to watch it, and I'll come back with you with the, re with the results. Okay, so I s stopped it here. I don't think I can watch a full movie on VHS. And just let me explain why. Okay, so I made it 16 minutes in. Actually, I made it... 15 minutes and, and 19 seconds in, and I could not continue watching and there are three reasons why number one clearer picture now the picture on the left is the picture of a scene from the vhs tape picture on the right is a picture of the exact same scene but from disney plus now notice in the picture on the left that when it's paused, it's a little bit fuzzy. It's not very di it's not very clear to make out. On the picture on the picture on the right, it's much more clearer to make out. You could see everything that's happening. You could see the leaves and the trees and Simba and Zazu. On the left, you can see all those things, but they're just not clear. 
You know what I'm saying? They're not clear. Number two, the colors pop out. The colors do not pop out as much as a streaming service. Now, on the photo on the left, they're, you know, they're light. They're lighter. They don't pop up, pop, pop out as much. Um, and maybe it's because of the quality. I mean, it, it is a VCR, um, so maybe. But the picture on the right, the, pip, the colors just pop out. They, they are so beautiful and so chic, I guess is the proper way of saying it. So they just pop out a little bit more. And the third and final reason is just because, I mean, the streaming service is better. It's just better coming from the streaming service rather than a v VHS tape. Now, I appreciate the nostalgic value of a VHS tape. I mean, I grew up watching VHS tapes and DVDs. Like, that's what I grew up on. But now with streaming services and looking so much better, I don't think I could ever go back to a VHS or a DVD. I just don't think I could do it. Because, I mean, with the quality of a Blu-ray disc or a streaming service, you can't beat quality. Like, the quality of a DVD is okay. The Blu-ray is great. The streaming service is the best. So that's what I'm going off of, is quality. It's just look, it's just a better quality. A VHS tape is a VHS tape. It's what you got. It's an actual tape that's rolling back. A, a streaming service, you can go back wherever you want, and it's, it's just better. You get what I mean? So, as you could see, I could not make it the entire way through. I couldn't even make it past 15 minutes watching a VHS tape. And also, another another reason is the VHS tape on a, on a screen that's 16 by 9 ratio, and it's a 4 by 3 aspect ratio on a VHS, on a VCR. You get those black bars on the side because it was made for a 4 by 3 television. So with these black bars on the side, it's it's cutting off like half of the setting of around the movie. With a streaming service, it is remastered, so you get the entire like scene, the entire graphics, the entire movie without it being cut off, and like how it was in a movie theater. So, I mean, would I recommend watching a VHS tape? Yeah, I guess, for nostalgic value. Would you ever want to switch over to using VHS tapes all the time? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. If you have Disney+, Plus, just use Disney+, Plus because it's great. Because it's great. If you have streaming services, that's great. But if, and if you have Blu-ray discs, that's also great. But would I ever go back to VHS as a, as a mainstream entertainment platform? Absolutely not. All right, and that's all I've got for you today. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe and punch the bell. I make new videos every Monday and Thursday, starting now. Um, that, this Thursday will be the return of Is It Really That Bad? Covering The Jungle Book 2. Um, that came from a comment from my previous video asking me to do The Jungle Book 2 by Isaiah. So, big shout out to you. Um, and yeah, so Jungle Book 2, Is It Really That Bad? will be coming out this Thursday. And then the, the following Thursday after that, I think I'm going to do Is It Really That Bad? every Thursday now. Either, either every Thursday or every other Thursday. Either twice a month or four times a month. But anyways, we'll just have to see. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and punch the bell because I make new videos every Monday and Thursday. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!